If you've landed on this channel, you are probably thinking about moving to the wonderful Greenville, South Carolina area. All I can say is welcome and congrats. This is the best place to live in all the United States. Now in this particular video, I'm going to talk about all the new construction in and around the Greenville market. Now make sure and stay tuned to the end of this video. I'm gonna let you know of a brand new concept uh, coming to Greenville that we have not seen yet. It is going to absolutely shake up this area. Now, I am Mark Rucker, and I am your hometown realtor. I've actually lived in the upstate of South Carolina for 46 years now. I've been serving the real estate community for over 20 years. I receive calls, text, social media messages, emails almost daily about people moving here to the Greenville, South Carolina area. Now, if you are within one in 100 days of moving to Greenville, contact me. I would love to be your hometown realtor. Also subscribe below and comment below because we would love to hear your thoughts about our area. It is my pleasure to be your resource to all things Greenville. Now, back to all the wonderful new construction here in the Greenville, South Carolina area. Now I have stated actually in other videos on this channel that South Carolina is the number three inbound state in the United States. That's, that's pretty crazy, isn't it? Um, now with that, we have many relocating buyers looking for homes. Uh, actually, Greenville is an absolute hotbed for new construction because all of those relocations are coming to this area. Now in particular, in 2023, one third of our home sales were actually new construction. And so far in 2024, as of April right now, more than 40% of the inventory on the market is new construction. So why are so many buyers choosing new construction? Well, the main reason, one of the main reasons are interest rates. As of April, interest rates are hovering around seven to seven and a half percent. Most home builders have in-house mortgage companies that they're partner with, and they can offer much lower rates, some in the 5% range. Now that is a substantial difference in your mortgage payment monthly. Also, most builders are offering concession packages. Some are offering 15,000, 20,000 concessions off the price, but also uh, would offer upgrades to the home as well. So coupling the interest rate and concessions, that is hard to beat y'all. Uh, that makes it extremely hard for resale homes to compete in this market. Now, every buyer of course, doesn't want new construction, but some do. Um, some would rather have more of an established neighborhood with trees, mature landscaping, and a lot more greenery. However, we work with multiple relocating buyers to this area that'll call us and say, hey, um, we're not gonna buy new construction because we don't want the cookie cutter home and the no trees. But guess what? They walk into a new construction, they get wild, and they end up purchasing one. Isn't that funny? Now, some of the feedback here uh, in the area is buyers are not interested in big time production builders because they're built in three to four months, uh, have no character, and they're built like a box. Now, some of that is true, and you will certainly see that uh, some here in Greenville. However, we do have multiple custom home builders itching to build on your land. We also have new construction condo and townhomes, and even tiny homes we have here in the area. We also have semi-custom home builders uh, that'll give you uh, an options on multiple floor plans, but also give you the option to add some extra upgrades. And then we also have spec home builders who only build two spec from the ground up. Now you normally do not see uh, the spec homes hit the market until about 60 days from being completed uh, to close. So, where are all the new construction homes? I'm gonna to touch on a few areas that are rapidly growing with all the new builds. Now, for years, Simpsonville, South Carolina, 
was one of the hottest markets in all of South Carolina. Simpsonville is starting to get kind of outgrown now. Uh, things have gone even more south. So right now, Fountain Inn, South Carolina, is an absolute hot pocket. Now, Fountain Inn is just a few miles south of Simpsonville. Uh, it's about a 20-minute ride to downtown Greenville. Now, here in Fountain Inn, the average uh, new construction home on the market in April 2024 is $371,400. I'm going to highlight a few of the neighborhoods. Uh, you have Brighton Meadows first. This is actually a Meritage Homes community. Now, Meritage is one of those spec home communities that I referred to earlier. So you can't go in, you can't pick your lot, pick the home you want to build, and then build from ground up. All the homes, again, hit the market uh, when they're about, I'd say, 60% to 70% done. Now, um, Meritage is known for its fabulous incentives for home buyers. Absolutely wonderful. Now, Brighton Meadows, if you have a good combination of one level and two story homes, you may want to check out Brighton Meadows. Now, as I'm cutting this video, the average price point in Brighton Meadows is $328,400. That is well below the average price in Greenville. The community does a very good job of local, um, super affordable price point. A second Meritage home community is Wexford Park. Now, Wexford Park is a little more upscale. The average price point there is $395,200. In Wexford Park, you're going to get more features per home and a fantastic amenities for the community. You have common areas, tennis court, uh, neighborhood pond. The Homeowner Association is $550 per year, and uh, that's going to pay for all those amenities, of course. Now, the last neighborhood in Fountain Inn I want to highlight is Parkland Hills. Now, this neighborhood is built by Toll Brothers. These homes are absolutely beautiful, and they are a semi-custom. Now, in April of 2024, they currently have 30-year fixed-rate promotion, um, and buyers can qualify less than 6% interest rate. Awesome. Now, this neighborhood average price point is in the mid-500s. Toll Brothers is known for their amazing upgrades, such as uh, the cave shower, they call it, and uh, the gorgeous chef kitchens. Now, another hot pocket for new construction is North Greer. Now, Greer is an eastern suburb of downtown Greenville. And depending on where you are in Greenville or Greer, it's about a 20 to 30 minute drive to downtown Greenville. Now, North Greer is actually inching towards the foothills of the mountains. So a lot of the homes have absolutely gorgeous mountain views. The average price point new construction in Greer is about 418,000. I'm gonna highlight a few of the new construction neighborhoods in Greer. Let's start with O'Neill Village. Now y'all, O'Neill Village is loved by locals. O'Neill Village is known as a very closely knit family community of Greer. It has crafted single family homes. It has town homes. It has retail of very creative amenities in there. Uh, to name just a few of the amenities, you have athletic fields, exercise facility, uh, a dog park, and a nice community pool. Now, Neal Village sits on approximately 195 acres, and the neighbors call it a perfect balance of live, work, and play. Now, there are multiple builders in this community you could choose from. Now, as it stands in April of 2024, there are eight new construction homes on the market right now, ranging from 318,000 to 575,000. Now, other neighborhoods um, in the Greer area, you have Chestnut Grove, which is another Meritage home community, Brookside Farms, which is a DR Horton community. Uh, Brookside Farms is primarily in the 300,000s, but you also get that, uh, you get a clubhouse, you get pool, uh, walking trails in there. A community center it is a great bang for your buck now let's talk about um probably the hottest pocket in the entire greenville spartanburg area for new construction it's directly east of greenville and it is actually the uh highway 101 
in Highway 290 corridor on the east side. Now this area is absolutely booming. Builders from all over want a piece of this area. Um, let's focus uh, more specifically on the Reedville, South Carolina district. Now in this particular area, you have the Reedville Town Center that actually is underway uh, with construction and demolition right now. Now the Reedville Town Center will absolutely energize this entire area, I'm telling you. There's gonna be a brand new Main Street, uh, retail, apartment spaces, a new baseball field, of course the new town park, uh, amphitheater, a community center, and actually a brand new library as well. Uh, this area is gonna bring restaurants and new shops to the area. It's going to be amazing. Um, now this place right now, you can go in there and purchase a Ryan Homes in the mid 300 price range, um, right in the middle of the town center. Uh, now this community is gonna have a pool, recreation facilities, common areas, uh, actually the lawn maintenance is included uh, in the homeowner association. Now, if you prefer uh, more of an upscale type construction, there actually are numerous options here in the Greenville area. We do have some fabulous custom home builders in Greenville. However, most custom homes are actually not found on the open market. Now they will be happy to build a home on your land that you end up purchasing. But if you're looking for custom homes on the market, you may wanna check out Hartness, which is one of Greenville's most popular master community neighborhoods. I absolutely love Hartness. Or if you wanna go absolutely big time, look no further than the Cliffs Communities, which has world-class golf and absolute multi-million dollar homes. Um, also, if you would rather go the townhome route, the Greenville area has numerous new construction options for townhomes. Now, my favorite upscale townhome community is probably Parkland uh, Brownstones, which is actually in Hollingsworth Park. Holy cow. These are absolutely gorgeous. Uh, this area overlooks the wonderful Legacy Park. Uh, Hollingsworth Park is another ma master community it's very similar to Hartness. Has a town center, YMCA, restaurants. Um, it links to the wonderful Swamp Rabbit Trail. Now, um, you'll be spending a lot of money for these. Uh, these are gonna be well into the millions. So, um, you know, not really that affordable for most. Now, if you do want more affordable, there are some new construction townhomes that you can choose from. Uh, to name a few, you have Blue Ridge Cottages in Taylor, South Carolina. Uh, this is a Lennar home community, and you can purchase here actually in the mid to upper 200s, so super affordable. Um, you also could head north to Traveler's Rest, South Carolina, and go take a look at Gatesway Village. This is a DRB homes community, and this price range also is in the 200s. Now, if you don't want to spend in the millions, and you don't want to spend in the lower 200s, we got you. There are some very nice townhomes in the 400 to 500 thousands, such as Hugh on Green, which is just a few minutes outside of downtown Greenville. Now, if you want, the, if you like the high-rise condo route, then and you want to be right in the middle of everything in Greenville, right downtown, check out Broadview Greenville, right smack in the middle of downtown Greenville. Now, lastly. Um, I want to talk about the brand new concept coming to Greenville I referred to earlier in the video. We have seen nothing like this, y'all. It's going to be huge. Greenville is one of the top destinations for retirees uh, moving here. And we have our first Dell Webb community coming to the heart of Greenville. Now, if you don't know much about Dell Webb communities, you will soon, I promise you. They're mainly in the Southeast, uh, primarily on the Florida and South Carolina coast. But Del Webb is a, Del Webb Greenville is going to be a 55 plus community. And it's gonna have pickleball courts, uh, bocce ball, uh, outdoor pool, scenic river walks. You gotta check this out. Also, there's gonna be a 9,000 square foot clubhouse with a fitness studio, a ballroom, and tons of event space. 
Now this is gonna be a 290 acre community with 434 single family homes with your choice of 1,300 to 2,200 square foot floor plans. Um, all one level, but there, there is a second level option. Also sunrooms are options. Uh, the first community sales here will be in 2025. So spring of 2025, this is gonna be a hit. Now y'all, if you're wondering where I'm standing right now, this is a brand new construction home, obviously in the framing process, but uh, we're in the middle of downtown Fountain Inn. This house going up here is gonna be 3,000 square feet. It's gonna be in the mid 700s range. And we are in within walking distance of downtown Fountain Inn, which is just that way. A five minute walk to Swamp Rabbit Trail, phenomenal location. If you want more information on this house, there's actually one being built right beside it. Give us a call. Uh, we'd love to get you in here, give you all the info right up front. Now y'all, I do appreciate you watching this video. Um, please be on the lookout for more videos about living in Greenville, South Carolina. Remember, I'm your hometown realtor, and I want to be your resource for all things Greenville. Thank you.